Well, we're just having the best date day ever. I ordered a um, sugar cookie frappuccino and they accidentally made me, what is that? A mocha cookie wrap. Mocha cookie wrap. So I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. I don't think that's the right drink. And then she's like, oh, would you like to have it anyways? And Matt didn't order a drink, so we got super lucky. I went to Michael's. I got some yarn. I got a candle and a plate. No, I put the plate back. Oh, lights for Nixon's um, tree by his TP. He has lights, but these ones are cuter. And then we went to Costco for a quick little jaunt and Matt bought stuff. I bought salami. So we're on our way to the mall because I'm going to Bath and Body Works and Matt is going to Walmart for, oh my God, why don't, don't tell me the word. I gotta think of the word because I'm having a brain fart. Come on, pull it out. I'm thinking minnows, but that's not the right word. Minnows. Um, sardines. Matt wants to go get sardines. Tristan and Matt have been eating sardines. Matt and I are back from our date day and I thought I would do a little haul of what we got. So I won't show you everything because Matt bought some stuff that at um, Costco that we didn't plan on buying today, but it's not really that exciting. Oh, actually, Matt's standing behind me. I'm going to ask him to grab one thing. Can you grab the one thing that I picked out at Costco huh. that we used to make something? Maybe. Okay. And this is. Oh, oh! Goosey, come here! Come here, Goose! And um, Tay and Devin went to the Raptors game, so we're babysitting Goose today. Not that he really needs to be babysat, he's pretty, pretty self sufficient. So, the first thing I'm going to show you is one thing that I've wanted to get all year, all, well, all season, and I haven't gotten. Hello! Why are you so jumpy? It is the snowman Christmas cookie from Starbucks. I love these things and I just, I haven't had one yet for Christmas. So I can go get them. I got them. I got the goose. Mm -hmm. All right. Then since we were at Starbucks, we also went to chapters and I love books. So I like to make sure I have a little bit of a stockpile of books. Oh. <laughs> the goose just ran away. <laughs> Sorry, goose. It smells really bad. Um. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow, it stinks. <laughs> okay, so the book that I chose to get is called Lucky. Is part of the Reese Witherspoon's book club. And I haven't really gone wrong following her book club suggestions. Every book that I have purchased from her book club has been a winner for me. So I decided to give this one a try. It looks like a pretty light, easy read. I just quickly read like the synopsis about it or synopsis about it. And um, it's about a girl who has some issues with, um, the law and she wins the lottery but if she cashes in the ticket then she could be arrested for um her indiscretions so i'll let you know how it is i'm just finishing up another book now and then after we went to chapters we went to this bakery that i was trying to go to it's in st catherine's on i believe it's geneva street and it's called i think it says 55 but i bought this loaf of bread it just looks so beautiful no you can't eat that school. no but look how pretty it is it's like the most beautiful loaf of bread so we're gonna make some zupa tonight and have this loaf of bread and our first stop which i didn't mention what it was but it was michael's i wanted to get some more yarn to make 
some blankets, which Goose can lay on and snuggle with. So the wool I like is, is Woolies. And this one was on sale for 10 bucks. The smaller bundle of wool was $9. So this was a really good deal. So I feel like I'm gonna be able to make a decent sized blanket for about $50. I bought five rolls. And I crochet, I don't knit, but. And then we got this for Nixon's TV, which I, I might end up showing you later too, because it's gonna go on the Christmas tree by his TV. Their bowler lights, Christmas lights, this side actually might look better. But they're bowler Christmas lights. So I'm gonna put them on uh, Nixon's Christmas tree. Then I thought, uh, I don't need more candles, but I really want some Christmas ones because it's almost Christmas. So I picked out frosted sugar cookie. And this also came from Michael's. It was 50% off. So that means it was only $3 and 50 cents. And let me tell you, this was probably the deal of the day. Want to smell like goose? Mm. All right, so five balls of yarn that look identical to this. The lights, candle, and that's it from um, Michael's. And then when we were at Costco, there's something I've always wanted to try and Every time we go to this one particular Costco that sells like industrial stuff, it's more of the business center one. Um, we hem and haw about getting a pasta maker. So we got one. It's just the kind that goes on your countertop. And I think it was only $27. So it's not a huge commitment. If I suck at making it or I don't like it, I don't have to use it. So maybe we'll do a video of us trying to figure out how to make pasta. I don't even know how to cook a meatball to be honest. Every time I do they look disgusting. So I'm no um, Italian guru but I certainly like eating it. So I'm excited to try this. It just latches onto the side of the counter I think. So yeah we'll give it a try and see if we can make some pasta. Now for my favorite part. Well I don't know if it's my favorite but it's Definitely a fun part. Bath and Body Works had a buy two candles, get two for free. So I don't always go for those deals because sometimes I think they're just trying to make me spend more money when all I wanted was one candle. But this is a pretty good deal, so I, I couldn't say no. So I picked out a vanilla bean, which isn't a holiday one. It's it just smells warm and, and yummy and it'll be nice, Christmas or not. Oh, I got my goose hair in my mouth. Yeah. Mm. And then this one is red velvet cupcake. Matt said it tasted, smelt like wax. And maybe it does a little bit, but I think it smells amazing and I like the container how it's like plaid it looks cute and winter-ish not necessarily Christmas so I can keep it out and use it after the holidays and then this one oh this one smells so good this one is cranberry pear bellini okay I can't the next candle and this candle are probably my favorites and maybe I should have just got two of each of these because they're really freaking good. And I like the cute um, plaid pattern on the glass too. Not necessarily too festive so you can keep it after Christmas. And this one, oh, this one's Christmassy. This one has like nice Christmas details around the lid. Oh, oh my God, this one's heaven. And it's called uh, Champagne Toast. I think this one might be my favorite. Oh, it's so good, like so good. And it's really cute too. It's like a shimmery pink with snowflakes on it. And it's just really, really cute. And I really like the lid. I feel like I should have switched out all my lids for cute lids instead of just plain Bath & Body Works one. But anyways, that was pretty much our, our haul. We got a few things at Costco, nothing crazy, just some um, 
big containers like totes that we like to use for when we go up north and stuff. So it was pretty, pretty relaxing. It was a good, fun day. Matt doesn't generally like shopping much, but he, uh, he did well. Oof, I can't wait to use this. Look how cute it is. dogs. Now I got Nixon. Oh, you, want my cookie. you can't eat my cookie. No. So I'm going to fill up some candy jars with some mm, Christmas decorations. I'm probably going to eat the rest of this for dessert tonight with this. With the coffee and some goose snuggles and some Nixon snuggles after we have soup and eat our yummy bread. So I'll show you the candy we bought and I'll show you the soup I make too. Cause it's a really easy soup. It's a copycat soup from, excuse me. It's a copycat soup from Olive Garden. It was delicious. So we're gonna do that tonight. Tristan's here for dinner and then he's going out with Kyra. Oh, we just Matt and I, and I think I'm gonna Christmas movie it up. We have Disney Plus until the end of the month, and there are so many Christmas movies. So I think we're gonna binge watch some Christmas movies. See you in a bit. Goose, are you snuggling with Grandpa? Hi. Oh, he's a good boy. He is good. Boy. He's a very good boy. And Nixon's joining in the snuggles. Okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, you little snugglers. Okay, okay. Are you in there, Goose? No. Oh, hello, eat up. You get him. You get him, Goosey. Yes. And you get snuggled too. Okay. All right. So I had started a fire a little bit earlier, and we just love sitting in front of it and chilling out for the night. Got my cookie close by. I'm gonna light my, I, I don't know if it's my favorite or not, but we're gonna light the champagne toast candle. I'm so pumped. Mmm. Oh, babe, that looks great. <laughs> Why is he such a dork? I love it. <laughs> <laughs> So Matt was kind enough to fill up one of my candy jars already. I think these are called eggies. Is that what they are? Yeah. They're, well, they're called goodness. What? Goodness. Oh. They're um, like those Easter kind of egg things where they're like candy shell with chocolate on the inside. And I think these ones have uh, candy cane in them. Do they, babe? Uh, they taste like it, like minty a little bit. Well, I can't really... I can't break it and show you, but mmm, it's good though. Oh yeah, they're minty. Mmm, they're really good. Christmas jupe jupes, which are just basically my two favorite colors of jupe jupes, red and green. I just opened it to get the fire going. You okay? Mm -hmm. A piece of birch in there. Did you <laughs> take the? Oh wow, these those don't smell like actually red, red regular jupe jupes. Really? Yeah. Matt always has to play with the fire and throw weird shit in it. I love it. But it's weird when you do it like in the house. Look at it; it's great. Come sit with me. No. All right. So smell these. Like Come here and smell them. They smell. Different. Right? They smell terrible. You think? I don't, I don't think they smell terrible. Yeah. They smell like plastic. <laughs> okay, Matt thought a candle smelt waxy. These taste like wax. Oh, when you're desperate, you'll eat them. Ah, no goose, don't eat them. Nope. Ah! Get 
in there. Oh, it almost fit the whole bag. Oh, it? it did. Because the ones I dropped on the dusty floor won't go in the jar. I just have old mason jars that we put like holiday candy in if it's Valentine's Day, we put Valentine's Day chocolate or candy in it. Christmas, you do the same thing. And a couple weeks ago, maybe even a month ago, maybe a month, I bought these Sour Patch Kids and their Christmas colors. Tay and I shared some, so she already took like, I'd say a jar full and we've gone through a jar full and we still have like half the bag left. Go school. They also have a recipe on the back for Sour Patch Kids cookies, Ew. which sounds disgusting. <laughs> Ew. Well, maybe, I don't know. I, I don't think I'd want them in my... Mm. I don't think I want them in my cookies. I'm a chocolate chip. Maybe throw some nuts in a cookie, but that's, that's about it. Candles burning nice. Ooh, this one went rogue. He's going in my mouth. So this is the holiday candy lineup. We got the Sour Patch Kids. Boom, pretty yummy. We have the Eggies. We've got the Jelly Beans and the Jube Jubes. All lined up and ready to go. Mm. All right, we're turning on the Christmas lights. Oh, there's like settings. Wow. This is Nixon's teepee with his bowler lights. Oh my goodness. Hey Tristan, come and look at this. <laughs> I wonder if I like it better flashing. What do you think? No. Yeah. Well, that's oh, that's dim and then those are fantastic. Okay. The Zupa is cooking. It's got about 10 more minutes-ish until we're ready for the next step. And then I'm making some boiled potatoes for hash browns and don't mind how dirty my stove is. It's gross. This is the finished product. I think everyone likes this soup. Tristan likes it too. He doesn't like uh, potato and leek soup, but this one he can, he can do. This is a bread from that bakery that Matt and I went to today and it's delish. <laughs> Let's eat. <laughs> well, I think we enjoyed our soup. Everyone ate it all. Bread's almost all gone and the dog's got none. <laughs> The big thing that's so boring me. So boring me. You want to make this chocolate. All ready to snuggle in for the night. I got my cookie that I took a bite out of. And some tea. And I got dogs and Matt. And I'm watching a movie over there too. Cheesy, chick flick, Disney. Christmas movie. Well, they say it's Christmas, but I don't know if it is or not. So it kind of looks Christmassy. He's making fun of me. But whatever. Goose prefers to lay on pillows. So we made sure he had a pillow. And I'm also going to start making Goose his own little blanket. I made one for Nixon on that chair over there. It's just so it keeps like the chair clean, but he's got his own little blanket to roll around in and whatever. So I'm going to enjoy my tea and my cookie. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. What? 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 Yeah.
chocolate. We're gonna snuggle in. Bye. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for some rare footage of Matt in the kitchen. I'm getting ready to wrap um, all the stocking stuffers, which is like my least favorite thing to do. I should really start wrapping them at the beginning instead of at the very end. But either way, that's what I'm doing today. I'm on day four, possibly longer of not washing my hair and I feel disgusting. So today is definitely going to be a hair wash day. And I think Matt and I might try to use the pasta machine. I don't know. And Tristan's coming home. So, and I, I need to make cookies too. I need to make some cookies. So today's a, a busy day, but I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys have a great weekend or had a great weekend. And we'll see you next week or later today. I don't know. It does mix it a little bad. And oh. He's hiding. <laughs> That's making Brookie. Oh, here goes the flat. I'm so excited. We haven't had a big breakfast in forever. Oh, you're cooking it so perfect. Baby, the sun really is in your face. Oh, yeah. It's It's a magical, magical day. Wake it up. And I'm so dirty and gross. <laughs> I haven't brushed my teeth yet. I haven't washed my hair in four days. Um, I'm a sight. And he's making me breakfast. He still loves me. Not kidding. Because that looks pretty good. Oh my god. Who needs a restaurant? Babe. Oh, you right? knocked it out of the park. I know. Oh my goodness. Oh. The gooeyness. Mm-hmm.